All right, y'all. I'm gonna start it back up. Um, the house hunts. Now we have been. We have looked at a few more properties here lately. That definitely wasn't it. They definitely looked totally different uh, in person than they did online. One of them was like, I think it was like almost two and a half, three acres. Got there. Mm -mm. But now we're finna head back and uh, look at some properties today. And hopefully we have some luck and find something that we want. <music> This house is on a little bit more than three quarter acre. Might have got a couple of fig trees already. A decent sized backyard. Got another building back here. I know I've seen online that has water and electric in that. Two more storage units back there. Had like a pecan tree, muscadines. All oh, this will have to come down. All oh, that tree, that tree, this tree, whatever that is, that tree is dead. Yeah, it's a large laundry room. Yeah, you can make a pantry in here too. Half bath. <laughs> Oh, they got a little pantry right here. They tried to turn this into a little pantry. That's cool. Got a whole whole bunch of stuff. Mm, that could probably maybe be gadget. You know, it's one of those where you can cut it all over there and you can cut it off over here, so one has to be, which is nice, but at the same time, you gotta kind yeah. of figure it out. <laughs> yeah, the kitchen is definitely a total redo. Yeah. To the family room, okay. Wood burning stove can't beat those. I like that. Yeah, the master bedroom, deep, long room, walk in closet. Second bedroom. Yeah. So this is how you come into this house. Do a walk through. Closet here. Look like that. Bath here with the tub. Guest bedroom. I really, really like this house. master bedroom got one closet here has another walk-in really good size walk-in closet there always make this uh turn this into a double bearing it has to win 
and we're going to always replace that. Toilet here, shower, could be retiled, light and fixture fix, I mean replaced. Linen closet. Another linen. Third bedroom, that's very, very good size. That's the uh, family room. Masonary fireplace. <laughs> the backyard is clear, I love it. Look that you have a brick um, and concrete uh, patio. Huge backyard. Got pecan trees, oaks. A bunch of some of the stuff got to come out of here, but I love it. I like this guy. French doors on here. And then you can open it up from this side, French doors. For a few days, my mom and her husband's family. The kitchen. Has a pantry. Nice garage. And now uh, it has a central vacuum system here too. Of course, you know, some stuff, all the appliances have to be replaced. Got another patio on this side. The screen down. Another view of a storage building of some sort. Of course, this big oak tree right here will have to come down. Too close to the house. Probably that pecan tree. Laundry room, freezer in here. You get an iron bowl, but you can always have shelving in here for all your uh, kitchen gadgets and whatnot. And then you, yeah, and then there's blood whistle you got. Dining room here. And then so you do like four or five, and then you'd have to go sprint 30 yards, come back. Which will probably turn into a, uh, probably shelving's office. So you can back your RV in right here. With that big tree right there, that big boy have to go. Probably that pecan tree, but they got a lot of pecan trees. Plenty of places to put fruit trees. Beautiful house from the outside. This one's the cross street from the house that we just looked at. I got cabinets in the garage. And 
I'm mad about that. Doesn't have some kind of storage building or something behind it. Laundry room is coming out the garage. Storage. Half bath. Oh. This is actually probably could be considered a bedroom. Has a closet off the garage with a half bath. Kitchen. Guess this will be your formal dining. Family room. The Small bedroom, could be your office. Walk-in closet is a good size, so that's the master bedroom. Huge walk-in closet. So, this bedroom connects to that bathroom, which is also, I guess the bathroom that anybody on this floor could use. Go up the steps. Yeah, I don't know what it must do, but wow, that's huge up here. Crazy how big it is up here. Full bath. I never seen a vanity sink with that close to just that's cool. Boy, your grandkids, this be a playground. Big playground. <laughs> you see, it goes around. It goes around. Yeah. <laughs> like, man, this is crazy. This would be a playground for the grandkids. Like, y'all go upstairs and play. <laughs> Cause I'm not coming up here, especially when I get old on these knees. Man, there's plenty of attic space up here. Nice little picnic area. Nice area for your garden. I got this one. What's this? All right, so guys, we did look at quite a few houses while we were down there. Some houses we got to, we didn't even go inside. We pulled up, to, nope. You know, so we did that to a few houses. But we did see one house in particular that we kind of liked. That's the one that was on one acre, uh, it was three bedroom, two bath. It's going to need some work, whatnot. But as far as the bones are concerned, brick house, nice, nice neighborhood. 
Um, we like that one. So we're going to see what we can do. You know, maybe we get that one, maybe not. But, you know, we got our eyes kind of set on that as of right now. All right. So, but, but if that falls through, we're going to keep looking. And the right proof there. Yeah. See what she said. Yeah.